name is Chris from ChristopherHall.com. Uh, thanks for coming to this video where we're going to be talking about two types of osteoarthritis. The first one is primary osteoarthritis, which is here on the left, and the second is secondary osteoarthritis, which is here on the right. Primary osteoarthritis is slightly easy to describe. Uh, it's associated with normal wear and tear that comes with aging. It's seen at the spine, thumbs, knees, and the top two finger joints. And there's no specific his history, injury, or trauma to the specified joint, be it spine, thumb, knee, or finger joints. When it comes to secondary osteoarthritis, it is associated with hereditary injury or obesity. So if we look at injury first, it may be a history of injury to the joint, such as a fracture or a tear, or it could be a history of trauma, such as repetitive lifting or kneeling. So this bottom one is more to do with repetitive injury over time, whereas this one might be a little bit more sort of an initial impact, for instance. If we talk about hereditary diseases, such as hemochromatosis or hyperparathyroidism, uh, these are to do with iron, calcium or copper storage. Neurological diseases that result in the loss of nerve function, congenital disorders uh, that are to do with imbalance in the joints and bone disorders that affect the joints themselves. So there's a little bit more to it with osteoarthritis. So hopefully this video has given you some sort of insight into possibly your osteoarthritis or someone that you knows osteoarthritis or a client or a patient or whoever it might be. So many thanks for watching. Uh, my name is Chris and I will speak to you in a future video.